Now, after this morning's thunderstorm, you wouldn't think many people would be running 5K through Battersea Park, even if it's for charity. But tell that to the hundreds of runners who braved the elements all to raise money for a bypass machine. Among them, one young boy who, without such a machine, wouldn't be here today. Emma K. Yamulu reports. Meet Anthony Bennett. Three years ago, he fell ill, was resuscitated 12 times, given an 11% chance of survival, spent seven weeks in hospital, had four life-threatening illnesses. He now says he owes his life to one piece of hospital equipment. What I want to do today is take you on a very personal journey of mine, about a section of my life where I nearly lost that very thing, life. I had influenza B, staphylococcus and strep pneumonia all at the same time. My white blood cells went to zero. I was given about 10% chance to live. I had to be resuscitated 12 times. The odds of me surviving were very, very slim. My mum asked him, why are you crying? And he just simply said, I'm just so happy that I've got my son back. When he said that, something happened to me. And I started to think about, wow, I actually got my life back. And it was thanks to a massive team. Doctors, nurses, surgeons, nutritionists, play specialists, cleaners, the list went on. It was a massive team of people that came together and lent their superpowers to me to help me get my life back. We are Greenford High School, my old high school. Things have changed a lot since I came here last. And if I spend just a amount of time on my phone, watching TV, just studying, then I'm, there'll be like a massive improvement. And then you're more close to your goal. I know that's logically it's easy to say, but to hear that again, it motivates you more to go outside right now and just actually do some work. I had to learn how to squeeze a sponge ball, to touch my nose again. I lost all my weight. I had to learn how to sit up straight without falling over. I had to learn how to stand, how to walk again. I had to learn absolutely everything. But I made it. Life is a temporary experience that will come to an end. You're still a part of this magical one-off experience. Live it and love it. Thank you.